and testes that transport sperm cells that is gametes and nurture the developing offspring reproductive system is divided into two parts male reproductive system in this system testes produce sperm cells and at the same time store the cells testes are oval in shape in this system the vast differences which is a vascular tube transport the sperm containing fluid called semen the epididymis is a set of coiled tubes including the seminal vessels and prostate glands provide fluid which lubricate the ducts and nourish the sperm these seminal vesicles attaches to vast differences at the side of the bladder at the base of urethra the prostate gland surround the ejaculatory ducts the penis consists of two parts the shaft and the glands at the end of the glands there is a small split through which semen and urine passes out through urethra penis can contract and expand and is made up of spongy tissue female reproductive system the main parts of the female reproductive system are ovaries ovaries produce eggs when the ovum releases from ovary it passes through fallopian tube that is oviduct and there it meets the sperm when they meet together the process of fusion will start and forms zygote Now the fertilized egg zygote passes down and reaches to the wall of uterus before reaches uterus the zygote has become solid ball type cells called morula morula move together and form blastocyst which then get develops in uterus wall and form baby skeletal system Skeletal system determines the shape of the body. It protects the organs and works closely together with the muscular system to allow us to move. Skeletal system is made up of bones, ligaments and tendons. In skeletal system, tendons give attachment to bones with muscles. the bone tissues in the cavity of bones produce red blood cells and white blood cells human body has an endoskeleton that means they are located inside the body it consists of about 206 bones Most bones are hollow with marrow cells inside. Ligaments connect bones to bones and tendons connect to muscles. The skeleton is divided into appendicular skeleton that is bones of arms and axial skeleton that is skull backbone ribs axial skeleton the skull is made up of bones fused together the backbone is composed of 33 separate different size of bones called vertebrae 12 pairs of flat bones make up the rib cage its function is to support the chest wall appendicular skeleton appendicular skeleton are made up of pelvic girdle consists of three fused hip bones 
pectoral girdles consists of two collar bones and two scapulas that is shoulder bone the joints ball and socket allows freedom of movement in several directions it can be found between humerus and scapula femur hip bone hinge joint allows movements in a single plane example knee joint pivot joint allows freedom of movement of somewhat between ball and socket and hinge joint example wrist ankles joints of the skull are extremely strong and immovable smooth and slippery cartilage causes the ends of the bones to reduce friction during the movement the world of multimedia publishers and distributors for multimedia cds also available educational cds icsc cbsc ap state board games cbts dtp lifestyle medical astrology and many more contact us complaint world of multimedia first floor 105 pavani kamal opposite sbh gun foundry Hyderabad 500001 phone number 04066629647